Well, whether you're sending your kids back to classrooms or getting ready for another semester of virtual learning, our next guest has some suggestions to help you be prepared. Joining me now is Lauren Barth. She is the editor director at Mom Trends. Good morning to you, Lauren. Good morning. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. Thank you for joining us today. Let's talk about parents and, and what advice you would give them as they head back to school, whether it's in classroom or virtual this year. Yeah, so certainly this school year feels different for all of us, but regardless of whether your children will be going to school in a classroom or in your living room, you're gonna wanna prepare them. You're gonna wanna get them excited and enthused for everything that's ahead, and you're gonna wanna have some peace of mind. And that starts with getting everything you need. So parents know to stock up on the tried and true items, the pencils and the paper and the binders. This year, you might be adding a mask to your shopping list, but one item that often gets overlooked as we're doing our back-to-school shopping is a first aid kit. So now is a great time to replenish and customize your own first aid kit. So I like to have the makings for my own build your own first aid kit so that I can really customize it to my family's needs. Love that. What do you think the benefits are to building your own? So besides the customization, of course, I'm a really big fan of Band-Aid Brands Build Your Own First Aid Kit promotion. Here's how it works. You buy three participating Johnson & Johnson consumer health products and you automatically get this free first aid kit bag. It's got a really great, bold, fun design. You won't lose it in your medicine cabinet. And you can just put everything in there that you need and you can stash all your goodies in there. It's exclusively available at Target and on Target.com through the end of September. So scoop yours up now while supplies last. You know, I have three kids at home, so bandages are at the top of my list when I build my own first aid kit. I really like the Band-Aid brand Skin Flex bandages and their Water Block Tough Strip bandages. If your Kids will be going back to school in person and breaking in new sneakers. You might want to get some of the Hydro Seal blister bandages. Throw in some Neosporin. It's great for reducing infection and scarring. Maybe some Benadryl anti-itch cream. Mosquitoes are still out even as we wrap up the season. And that's a great starter kit. So that's a great way to have everything you initially need and then you can replenish as you see what your family needs. Perfect. And you know what? There's nothing more fun as a kid than putting on a fun Band-Aid. So <laughs> that's true too. Mm -hmm. You know, what do you think some parents um, should think about as best practices when they send their kids back to school with this new normal that we're approaching? Yeah, so keep those lines of communication open with you and your child, with you and your school and your teacher. Really right now, we all have to be a team. We're in this together. We have to work together to figure out what works for our kids, whether it's an at-home model, an in-person model, a hybrid of both. Um, you know, and then practice some healthy habits at home with your kids to get them prepared. Make sure that they know to adequately wash their hands frequently. Have them practice wearing their mask at home, even if they're not gonna be doing in-person instruction. It's the new normal for a bit so they should get used to how it looks and how it feels you know try to discourage them from touching their faces so often that can be trickier than than <laughs> that could be trickier with little kids at home um, and talk about why it's important to provide adequate social distance between themselves and their buddies you know it seems really daunting as parents to have to teach our kids about these things and have these difficult conversations and enforce these healthy habits but kids are sponges they're adaptable and they will get used to this new normal and maybe have an easier time with it than even we do that's so true. Kids are, they're malleable. They, they are better at following the mm -hmm. rules than we are too. So, you know, Absolutely. I think it'll be, yeah, good to keep those lines of communication open, like you said. Are there more resources people can visit if they want more information about you or Mom Trends or even the first aid kit? Yeah, so for more information on the Band-Aid brands, build your own first aid kit promotion, you can go directly to Target.com to scoop yours up there. And for more Mom Solutions, you can follow Mom Trends on social media. Perfect. Thanks so much for joining us, Lauren. Thanks for having me. Absolutely.